We have seen the lines forming outside uh, downtown, uh, specifically outside the library. People are now waiting in line for their appointment to get their stimulus money. And that is where we find News for Jack's reporter, Jim Pickett. The uh, process, Jim, has not been without a couple of issues. Well, it has been some problems, but for the majority of people that we've been talking to here, and there are some people still waiting to go in for their appointment here, they're going to be going throughout the day, they told us it was smooth as could be, and they were quite surprised by that. Yet, there are some people that came down here, and there was some confusion with their addresses, basically because of what is happening there or with the addresses that somebody else may have had it. Uh, I did talk to one person standing in line this morning who really said that this is going quite well. Here's what she told me. It's very, very important. I have three children and um, my husband's out of work. Um, I'm a dental hygienist. And so because our profession is like the most hazardous, we haven't been able to work. I haven't worked since March the 6th. Um, unemployment, as everybody knows, has been almost impossible to get through and everything. So this will really help to pay my rent, to um, get food for my family and uh, I, it's really important I thank the, the mayor for doing this for us and uh, it's great. I'm staying out here as long as I need to. And the lines this morning, well they were wrapped around the library but now that they've got this going you can see, well when the cars go by, that it's actually going quite well and people have been coming out with their card saying they've got this money and as I said, they said this was going so smooth. The problem of course have been with those where addresses have been duplicated. During the mayor's news conference, he did address that and what we were told is that they're going to contact those people that came down here that there were problems if other openings come up and they hope to resolve that. So don't expect to see, like we saw on Friday, the computer lines opening up for appointments. That's not going to happen. They're going to contact those who would qualify that weren't able to get in, at least on this first day. From the library, Jim Pickett, Channel 4, The Local Station.